want to make changes. Right on the point, just past the stick of Lehman. And it's picked up there by Sarah Benz. Sarah Benz. A good start for the Swiss as they come out strong here in this second period. Late into the corner, Lehman waiting for it there. Trying to get the return feet. She was checked by Curtis Scott, comes out in front, a chance for a goal. I guess the coach had a time with these. The ladies in that first intermission. Yeah, a little more aggressive on the forecheck. They actually had an entire line change there, so they got fresh legs out of these teams. We knew who hasn't been able to change these five that started this period. All of them. Well, flip it into the corner. Even if you're going after it, you're it behind the net. Check by Anderson. It comes to Lisa Feinberg. She can't get it out. Julia Marty is able to keep it in. Marty's back in. That goes wide. Camilla Anderson stopped by Sarah Benz. Sarah Benz with it now, centering pass. And Hatlinger had her stick, stick tied up to get another shot. The Swede just want to get it out. Tallman keeps it in. Shot right on to the wide. And Sarah Benz was in front. Now, Obla at center. Spins around as the Swedes want to make changes. Here comes Obla and a nice defensive play there. By Amelia and by... Ulo. Nice work by Aileen Holmlock. It was a two minute shift for that first line to see Swede. She was still able to dangle and get the puck in deep. Same rules apply at the ice, and the lines can't change. So she was well aware of that, got over the red line, and the entire squad was allowed to change. Nussbaum with a pass that gets deflected by Navals right into her own bench. Well, some nice pressure early in the second period from Team Switzerland. You can see a nice shot, Julie Hardy from the point, Sarah Benz in front. And Kim Martin had to be really sharp. This was tipped just in front of her, so it changed directions at the last minute. And not, not facing many shots so far in this game, so she's really got to be focused, and that's tough for any goaltender. The stage is four shots in that first period for Switzerland. But a much better start for them here in the second. Up the middle. Here's the Schneider. on top by the score of one to nothing. Fifteen seventeen. 
to go here in the second period. Sweden on top by the score of one to nothing. But the Swiss have come out strong in this second period. Riesteiner will line up against Rolls from the draw. Rolls wins it. People got her stick in there, and Rolls was looking around, but she controls the puck in the corner. Now in behind the net is Eliasson. And again, as Cassie mentioned, the Swiss are clogging things up in the middle. Now an opportunity. Long shot, and that one is steered wide. And Dorothee let it go. Deepa. She stopped it behind the net. Fine Burke plays it out in front. Bouncing puck. Holmes just took a shot. Ruth couldn't get it loose. And Holmes was denied as well. Here's Homla. Makes it to Fine Burke. Gets it back again. And now she's bringing it in herself. Homla with a shot in a blocker save there by Schiller. Apples. As the Swedes start to put some pressure on. Apples trying to get it up. He'll get another opportunity. Play it off the boards and relieve the pressure. Off the skeet there of Lyndon Tunstrom. He'll get it back again. Tunstrom. Got it right back in. And Schelling has to come up with another big save. Well, the Swedes, Cassie, have come to light here. Well, they did a good job. They attacked that trap in the neutral zone with speed, and that created all these chances. It was Emma Nordine who got the initial pass, just brought it right into the zone because of her speed, and they've gotten about three or four chances because of it. Offside, here's the call. At the switch blue line. Over the past five years, Rona has provided financial support to a hundred Canadian.